So good evening, everybody. Welcome to today's session. Um, as usual, being a Sunday, we are here gathered here to look at health, how we can um, protect ourselves from disease, how we can live a longer, healthier life. And today we have a very, very special guest who will be talking to us and we are discussing diabetes. And uh, this is a lady who has walked the journey and she has an amazing, amazing story. Uh, but before we get to that level, we're just going to look a little bit and see what is diabetes, um, learn a little bit about diabetes, the causative factors, and how you can be able to protect yourself or even manage it uh, in case you already have the disease. Now, my name is Fred Gishuki. Fred is an entrepreneur with Neo Life International. I've been in the wellness industry now for more than 20 years. Um, I joined to make money, but I found that um, health was quite integral and quite important uh, in, in life. And I embraced it and I started uh, really getting interested in matters health. And our company gave us the relevant training where we learned a lot about how to protect ourselves from disease. Um, and I, I totally went full out uh, on it. At the beginning, when I got involved with this company, uh, my mother was suffering from uh, high blood pressure. My dad had ulcers and they used the Neolife products and they were really, really assisted. They now live a normal life. Um, those two conditions don't really bother them much. Later, my dad got a swollen prostate and uh, he also again used the Neolife products. I told him, dad, you're not going to go into surgery. You will just use the Neolife products and you'll be uh, together with medicine and you'll be good. And he was able to also con uh, manage that condition. So um, I've interacted with the products of Neolife and they've really done major, major things in my life. Uh, behind these products is also a business opportunity which I have uh, interacted with and I've done it. Um, I started this off as a side hustle um, and I found it giving me more money than my job. Uh, eventually, at the age of 30, I quit employment to do it on a full-time basis. It's been an amazing, amazing journey. Uh, the money is good. Um, I've also been able to travel quite a bit. I've been to America, South Africa so many times, Mexico, Mauritius, uh, so many, many countries with neo life. Um, and I, I really get excited when I talk about neo life because it has helped me to achieve so many dreams that I had as a young man, including uh, getting married, for example. I didn't want to get married and get into myself into what they call the vicious cycle of poverty. And uh, by the time I got into a six figure income with Neolife, I got married and um, I have four beautiful girls. Um, my wife also retired into the business. So it's an amazing venture in case there's anybody out there who is probably looking for something that they can do part-time as a business. I highly recommend that you look at Neolife, uh, get involved, and uh, we'll train you, we'll hold your hand, and we'll show you how you can be able to make money and also prosper with Neolife. But if you're out there and you're looking at matters health, how you can live a longer, healthier life, you also are the right place uh, at the right time. And um, I'm briefly going to share with you um, about our topic of today, how to prevent yourself from diabetes. And in case you already have it, how to manage it. Um, and uh, without further ado, I'm going to get right into it. As you can see the screen, that's our topic of today, how to prevent yourself from diabetes. And um, diabetes is a, is a disease that has affected so many lives. And uh, just a minute there. Um, and I've seen many people in my course of being involved with Neolife, I have seen so many people who have suffered from the disease. And in some cases, it becomes fatal. Uh, in some cases, um, people go through some very uh, painful uh, procedures like uh, amputation of the limbs and that kind of thing, uh, basically because of diabetes. And um, by definition, diabetes is a chronic disease that occurs either when the pancreas does not produce enough insulin or when the body cannot effectively use the insulin it produces. Now, insulin is a hormone that regulates blood sugar. Um, and when you talk about hyperglycemia or raised blood sugar, um, it is actually a common effect of uncontrolled diabetes. 
And uh, over, the, over time, this leads to serious damage to many of the body systems, especially the nerves and blood vessels. So, and I know uh, if you look at that diagram, it will tell you what happens. You eat the food with carbohydrates. Um, the carbohydrates are changed to sugar. Then uh, glucose enters the blood to, uh, to all the parts of the body for energy. Your pancreas senses the rise in blood sugar, so it makes insulin. And the insulin helps the sugar to get into the cells and into your body so that they can generate energy. That's how it's supposed to work ordinarily. But if anything happens and uh, the insulin is not being generated properly by your pancreas, then you find that that is when now uh, we start saying that you, have, you are starting to develop uh, diabetes. And um, we will look at now the types of diabetes that are there because uh, there are three common types that are there. And um, there is what we call the juvenile or insulin dependent uh, diabetes. And uh, this is actually where the body does not produce um, insulin uh, in the required amounts. And it's usually uh, associated with um, children. And that's why they call it infantile diabetes or juvenile diabetes. And some of the symptoms include excessive secretion of urine, um, constant hunger, weight loss, uh, fatigue, uh, vision changes, and the like. And some of these uh, symptoms occur um, suddenly, you know, um, and you may wonder, sometimes you wonder, why should a kid get diabetes and he's so young? Uh, and you're going to look at what are some of the reasons that could actually make a young person, a juvenile, actually get diabetes. Now, then we have what we call type 2 diabetes um, or non-insulin dependent or uh, the one that they call adult onset diabetes. And uh, this results from the body's ineffective use of insulin. Majority of people fall into this category, type 2 diabetes, and um, it's usually as a result of excess body weight and physical inactivity uh, that actually causes uh, this kind of diabetes. Uh, the symptoms are similar to those experienced in type 1 diabetes, uh, but are often less marked. Um, as a result, the disease may be diagnosed several years after onset. Uh, and this only happens when complications start uh, setting in. And this is a kind of diabetes whereby we actually get it um, like what we call through the fork and the knife. And um, right now, many children are now getting uh, type 2 diabetes, of course, because of the kind of diet that we are feeding them. And they become overweight and they get um, the type 2 diabetes. The other type of diabetes is called gestational diabetes. Uh, now, gestational diabetes is uh, hyperglycemia or too much blood glucose um, above normal. And this actually happens during pregnancy. Now, women with gestational diabetes are at an increased risk of complications during pregnancy and at delivery. Uh, now, these women and possibly their children are also increased, have an increased risk of type 2 diabetes in the future. So uh, as you can see the diagram there just shows you briefly uh, what happens and uh, how the diabetes comes in. And like you have seen there, that most people who have um, get this kind of diabetes, um, in case they have a high risk of actually contracting type two diabetes in the future, both the mother and the child have a high risk of contracting diabetes in the future. Yeah. Then we look at another different aspect of diabetes, which came recently with COVID-19. And uh, COVID-19 uh, brought in another um, uh, onset. It actually caused the onset of diabetes in a way, because we find that COVID-19 um, is a relatively new disease. And most of the people who got COVID-19 um, suffered a lot because they, it ended up affecting the pancreas and this had a negative effect on them. Now, uh, just give me a minute. I need to handle something here. The challenge of working from the house, but just give me a minute.
and I'll be back in a minute. Just give me a minute. Sorry about that. Somebody that I needed to sort out at the door. Okay, so um, so we were talking about COVID nineteen and the effect of COVID nineteen uh, on our bodies. Um, part of the effects that COVID nineteen caused and what has been seen is that after getting COVID nineteen, most of the uh, patients um, have their pancreas. Um, negatively affected by the side effects of COVID-19. And this resulted in them developing diabetes, yeah? And um, some patients who did not have diabetes prior to infection uh, actually developed uh, diabetes because of COVID-19. And we are going to look at it and see uh, how we can be able to prevent ourselves. If somebody has gotten uh, COVID-19, how can we then ensure that they actually uh, don't get diabetes? I remember dealing with a case of a young man uh, who had actually gotten uh, COVID-19 and uh, he ended up uh, getting diabetes. And you know he was actually about to get diabetes and his sugar levels were quite high. And uh, the mom called me and told me the, the young man has very high sugar levels and they are scared that he might develop diabetes. So I actually put him on some of our products and um, uh, he religiously took the products. And the good thing is that after using the program for a while, uh, his sugar level stabilized. Uh, so that even after he stopped using the products, uh, the sugar levels became stable. So, uh, but this is something that has actually uh, a new phenomena that has happened whereby uh, after COVID-19, you find that uh, people are developing diabetes, whereas they didn't have diabetes uh, before. And there you can see it, it says um, COVID-19 affects people in different ways. And um, it has been found that better cells of the pancreas are highly permissive to COVID-19 infection. Uh, the pancreas, which lies behind the stomach, um, and helps in, 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 uh, in digestion, also has what you call beta cells that make insulin. And the, the hormone that escorts sugar molecules from, from the blood into the blood body cells where it is used for energy. So when COVID-19 virus attacks uh, the, panc the pancreatic beta cells, uh, then insulin production actually decreases. And now that is where you find that now uh, diabetes actually starts setting in. And like I said, uh, this is something, and you see like COVID-19 has been around and it's a condition, it's a disease that we are learning to live with, but it is good to know that if you get COVID-19, then you have to really also take care of your pancreas because otherwise you might get diabetes. So that diagram there shows you some of the challenges of diabetes. You can get a stroke, you can become blind, you can get a heart attack, you can get kidney failure, or you can get your limbs amputated. So those are some of the challenges that uh, are associated uh, with um, getting diabetes. And that's a diagram again. Now, moving on a little bit there, um, Part of the reasons why we get especially type two diabetes can be looked at um, be, uh, as being as a result of having too much weight, having excess weight in your body. And we are going to look at uh, how does the weight affect you and what, why would you get diabetes when you have excess weight? And the diagram that is coming on is just summarizing 
the challenges that are associated with diabetes on your body. Um, and you can see there, they're talking about the stroke, they're talking about heart damage, nerve disease, um, diabetic foot, uh, renal failure, uh, eye disease. These are some of the challenges that are associated with diabetes. And again, the diagram there shows you what happens in your body for you to get some of these challenges. And I have seen many people who get diabetes and they don't manage it very well. And you find that at the end of the day, uh, the person is, is actually suffering from some of these conditions. Um, and it can be quite a challenge for the person, especially where it comes to amputation of the limbs. Um, and you start feeling numb, the limb starts feeling numb. And with time, the doctor advises that now the only thing we can do is actually amputate this limb uh, to save your life. And that can be a big, big challenge. I remember dealing with a client um, who was a very well-off gentleman. Uh, he had about three cars, um, stayed in Thome, he's a very, very rich man. But he could not even drive his cars because of diabetes. And he had he depended on drivers to come and help him to drive his own car. And it was a very, very sad situation whereby um, you have everything that you need, uh, that everybody needs, but now you cannot enjoy it because of the condition that you have. So let's look at some of the reasons why people develop type 2 diabetes and how can you prevent yourself from getting it. And um, there's a cycle there. There's an issue of diet, there's exercise, and there's rest. These are three things that are very critical for your health to actually ensure that you are actually uh, living a very healthy life. And it's important to exercise at least three times a week so that your heart can be able to pump and you feel uh, a difference. You feel that you are sweating a little bit. That is important so that your body can be able to burn excess fat uh, and, and actually uh, remain healthy. Then rest is important. You need to sleep at least six to eight hours on a daily basis, uh, which is very important to allow the body to produce uh, hormones that make you actually relax. Then the food that you're taking is very, very critical because your food will either build you or it will kill you slowly, yeah? And um, if your diet is not good, then you run a risk of actually getting diabetes. And if you're eating the modern day diet, if you look at that diagram, on one side, we have fruits, vegetables, uh, juices, very nice foods, uh, salads and the like. On the other side, we have pizzas, burgers, and all these things that are so yummy um, and the things that people enjoy. And the, the things that are very sweet to the, to the mouth, most of the time are the ones that will actually make you to have uh, diabetes. So it is important to know that the decisions you make at the table, what you eat at the table, plays a huge, huge role um, as far as your, your health is concerned. Now, let's look at BMI. What is BMI? It's called body mass index. And body mass index basically looks at your height um, and it looks at your weight and they're able to calculate an average uh, um, and see what your BMI is. Now you can be underweight or you can be overweight, yeah? And the idea is to ensure that you maintain a normal weight. And a normal BMI is between 18.5 to about 24.9. Uh, that's a normal BMI and that's where you should be. But you find that uh, some are underweight um, and some could be overweight. And this is some, these are, these are a statistic that you really need to pay close attention to so that you ensure that at the end of the day, your BMI is actually okay. Because when your BMI, when you become obese, when you start, when you become overweight, then you get into obesity, then you find that now you are running a risk of getting diabetes and other lifestyle conditions. So the BMI is a very good indicator. And how can you get the BMI? In Nairobi, we have some people who normally uh, measure your weight in town and they give you a receipt. Uh, there are some machines that they, that's the quickest way you pay 20 shillings stand on that thing, so long as it prints a receipt and it gives it to you, it will tell you what is your BMI. And you'll see whether you're in a good position or a bad condition 
or you can go to a medical practitioner and get it done for you. Now let's look at our diet. What should you be eating? Now, if you look at the pyramid on the left, uh, that is how we are eating. But the pyramid on the right is the way we are supposed to eat. Your diet should be rich in whole grains. Um, that is the most important part of your diet. Then followed by fresh fruits and vegetables, different colored fresh fruits and vegetables. Then the proteins, minimize on the proteins. Then the sweets and sugary things and fats, you get, you get very little of it. In fact, they say that you need a teaspoon of sugar and a teaspoon of fat per day, and that's good enough. But the truth of the matter is that we eat the other way around. Uh, too much, too many sweets and sugary things, uh, a lot of meat, proteins, very little in the way of uh, fruits and vegetables, uh, whole grains, we eat them when we cannot avoid. Now, when you're eating like that, when you're eating with your pyramid upside down, then a gap develops. And this gap is now where the lifestyle diseases come in because you find that when you're eating more of the processed foods, then your BMI goes haywire and you start getting other problems. Now, my sister is a nurse and she always tells me, Fred, the size of your belly uh, determines how close you are to diabetes. And if you have a big belly, uh, that's a fast indicator that you, are get, you have a lot of inflammation happening in your body and you run a very high risk of getting diabetes. And the battle for us men especially is to ensure that our belly uh, remains flat or manageable. Right? It doesn't grow too big. Now, um, there's a gentleman that you're seeing there called Jerry Brasfield. Jerry Brasfield is a very visionary gentleman uh, who started our company Neolife um, in 1958. And this is a guy who had asthma. He used some of our products, they worked for him. Then he, re he actually saw an opportunity to help many other people who have different challenges health-wise, um, actually be able to live a normal life like him. And he became a distributor of Neolife, ended up owning the company. And he formed what we call the Scientific Advisory Board. Scientific Advisory Board was led by somebody called Dr. Ada Fast. And uh, what Scientific Advisory do, uh, Board do is they do the research behind our products. They ensure the products are safe. They don't have a side effect. And when you use them, the products will actually do what we say they are going to do. And um, the company Neolife developed products that deal with various aspects of health. If you want to just stay healthy, uh, live an active life, we have products for that. If you're in sports, um, we have products for that. I mean, any kind of facet of life that you'd like to sort out in your life or just to live a long and healthy life without getting lifestyle diseases, then we have products for that. Now, let's closely look at which products are there for diabetes or which products are there to help you. Uh, to prevent you from getting diabetes as far as new life is concerned. One of the key products that we have is called ProVitality Plus. Now, when you take ProVitality Pack, uh, ProVitality Pack by itself is able to turn your pyramid from the left side to the right side, from being upside down to the right side up. Now, why is it able to do that? Simply because of this. ProVitality has four very important supplements, uh, starting with what we call trianen. Uh, trianen is the whole grains that we talked about. Uh, then we have carotenoid complex. Carotenoid complex has 18 different types of fruits and vegetables in it. So the fruits and vegetables are taken care of. Then it has minerals in it. Then it has uh, what we call uh, salmon or the fish oils, yeah? So it's an amazing, amazing product. Uh, that we have in our company. And that has, when you take it, one of the benefits of Pro Vitality is that you become so energetic. Uh, I remember sharing it with one of my customers. He used to have a lot of problems of sleeplessness and fatigue and sleeping at the wrong times. And he used Pro Vitality and he got so much energy. And he was asking me, friend, uh, I don't know what this thing you're giving me, but I am feeling on top of the world. He's a bit mature in age. And he was actually very, very excited about it. Now, what other products do you need uh, to uh, manage diabetes? One of the key products is called fiber tablets. 
Now, what does fiber tablets do? It basically reduces the speed uh, at which the refined carbohydrates are absorbed in the bloodstream. So you find that uh, your, the, the sugar that we mentioned earlier that when the sugar comes in at a very high rate, then it actually, it's one of the reasons why uh, diabetes comes in. So um, that's the first thing, fiber tablets. The other thing that fiber does for you is that it actually sieves about 80% of sugar from blood. It sieves 80% of sugar from blood. And it also gives you a feeling of satiety so that you don't, um, you actually don't overeat uh, when you are taking uh, the fiber tablets. The next product that is important is called CoQ10, CoQ10. CoQ10 has so many benefits. Um, it works, it's very good for your heart health. Uh, it helps to regulate sugar in blood. Uh, it prevents uh, development of cancer and that kind of thing. But one of the things that CoQ10 does is that it helps in rejuvenating your pancreas. If somebody has diabetes, then you find that when you take CoQ10, it, it, it helps your, your organs, your internal organs to function better, uh, to function at peak levels. And that includes, of course, your pancreas. And um, if, if, uh, if somebody has diabetes, this is one of the products that you give them. But even for somebody who is healthy, because like I said earlier, we are eating all these uh, processed foods and with time, our pancreas is being overworked without our knowledge. You don't have to wait until you develop diabetes. You can take CoQ10 and just ensure that uh, your pancreas is functioning uh, the way God intended it to function. So this is, these are two very critical products. The next product that is so important for diabetes is called chelated zinc. Now you find that the insulin that you're given from the hospital is more than 80% zinc, but the zinc that is in that insulin is actually a synthetic form of zinc. But now when you take uh, zinc, uh, chelated zinc from New Life, it is made from organic and natural uh, foods and vegetables that you normally eat. And when you take our zinc, then you find that it has so many benefits, but one of the key benefits is helping the pancreas uh, to produce insulin. So it is highly, highly recommended uh, for somebody who um, is suffering from diabetes or somebody who wants to prevent himself from getting diabetes. But it has so many other benefits from uh, ensuring your prostate is functioning properly, uh, for uh, preventing you from colds and flus. Um, I mean, zinc is just amazing. If you want your kids to grow to uh, the right size, the right height, um, uh, then you need zinc. Uh, zinc is so important. If you have young girls like I do and you want them to develop their breasts and just be nice, beautiful young girls, then you need to get them on zinc as soon as possible. And again, if you look at all the cough syrups, they have zinc in them. And that zinc is, I think, zinc sulfonate or something. Uh, and instead of going for that, why don't you use the natural and organic zinc? Another product that is so critical for diabetes is called Botanical Balance. Now, this is a relatively new product in our company. It came the other day. And Botanical Balance has one role in your body to regulate the amount of glucose in the body. And it's, it's an amazing, amazing product. It also helps you to burn a bit of kilos. I've used it and as I'm, even right now I'm using it. And it actually helps you to burn a bit of kilos in your body, especially belly fat. And it has the ingredients are, are quite interesting. Turmeric, curcumin, cinnamon. I mean, the herbs that you know, but it's actually formulated in a very, very exciting way. And this is the, actually the product I gave the young man who had uh, had COVID and then he recovered from COVID but now he was developing uh, too much sugar uh, in the blood and they were fearful that he was going to develop diabetes. And he used it and um, he's been good to go. I mean, since then he's not had that problem. Another product that is critical for people with diabetes is called the Neolife Shake. Neolife Shake uh, is made from with 22 amino acids. Um, it's very delicious. It's actually, you just make it into a shake or a smoothie and you take it. Uh, it's very convenient, um, and it, it one of the things that Neolife uh, Shake does for you is that it has what we call 
um, fiber in it. Uh, so the fiber works to actually uh, balance the sugar levels in your body. Um, New Life Shake will actually feed the cells. You find that because of diabetes, most people are, are told, don't eat this, don't eat that, avoid this, avoid that. Now, when you take New Life Shake, then you find that you're getting in the nutrients, the right proteins, but uh, you're not getting in the calories. So you find that at the end of the day, uh, it actually helps to strengthen the body. It also has what you call lipotropic factors, which actually helps to uh, cut the bad uh, cholesterol from your body. Another important product is called the Neolife Tea. And uh, this one helps, especially as far as uh, energy levels are concerned. It has uh, a green tea in it. Uh, it has very rejuvenating antioxidants uh, and also naturally occurring caffeine. Uh, it also, it gives you instant energy. And if, especially where you have a problem with the belly fat, uh, I highly recommend Neolife Tea. Uh, I have people who ask me, Fred, what do I take for belly fat? I'm okay otherwise, but it's just my belly which is giving, I mean, I want to cut this belly. What product can I use for belly fat? And my answer is usually one. If you, if you, if you can't buy the whole weight loss products, then go for Neolife tea. And when you get Neolife tea, then you find that when you take it, you start fitting better in your clothes uh, and you start actually burning the fat uh, from your belly. So these are some of the interventions and the products that we use uh, to actually manage, um, protect ourselves from diabetes. And also if we already have the condition or the disease, then you're able to use them uh, to actually uh, manage the condition. Now, before I conclude today's session, I want to uh, invite a lady. This is a lady I met recently and uh, she really moved me so much with her story. Uh, she has an experience and uh, she, she was diabetic, she's going to tell you all about it. And she has been able to use our products with a lot of benefits. So without further ado, I want to invite Mary Jenga. Mary, if you're there. Hello, good afternoon. Good afternoon, Mary, please take it away. Yeah, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you very well. Good afternoon. Okay, good afternoon. My name is Mary Jenga, as you have been told. Um, a banker by profession, having been in banking for financial agency. And uh, I found Neolife life when I was in a very desperate position. Um, it was, I was admitted by then. And uh, it was really desperate because the sugar levels were not changing. I was discovered to be diabetic in 20, 2008. And since then I've been in hospitals for three to four times a year. And needless to say, my finances were wrecked down. I was spending more than 60,000 shillings every month. Uh, for those who know diabetes, I was using two types of um, insulin. That is Novorapid and uh, Levema, six times a day. On top of that, I was also using Previamet. And by this particular time that I was coming to Neolife, I was admitted and uh, I wasn't discharged actually. I wrote a letter to the doctors against their will to discharge me because I was not changing. My sugar levels were stuck at 22. And you know, that is a killer. I wasn't changing. And when they are down the L, oh, the machine is not reading. So most of the time I was having these um, crazy sugars. And everybody was affected. My family was affected. At one particular time when I was getting very low sugars, and uh, when you get low sugars, you can do night looks like fainting. People are taking me out. And by the time they are taking me out, the neighbors are wondering what is not happening, including the kids. So one day I found like my kids are not going out to play. And I asked them, why are you not going out to play? They're like, people are telling us, your mom is sick and you're wondering. So we decided to stick indoors to pray. And that really affected my feelings. Uh, 
when I was getting to near life, it was worse because my family members had already taken my kids to stay with them. They were really getting affected in school. And uh, the doctors had called the family members and among them was my uncle who was really worried. It was hopeless, I was feeling like I'd given up in life. And when they narrated this condition in preparation of how difficult the condition was at this particular time, my uncle was like, why don't you just try your life products? You have nothing to lose anyway. So I wrote the letter and I attended the meeting. When I attended this particular meeting, uh, as usual, they wanted me to stay and listen, but my body was very weak. I couldn't see, my eyesight was lost. My voice was lost. So I was just telling them, just recommend anything that can sort diabetes. And uh, the person I found called Samuel, and Josphat, after the meeting, they recommended some products. It was on a Saturday afternoon, so I didn't get the products immediately. I got the products on Tuesday, and I was like, I just want to use them. I started using the products, and um, uh, when I started using the products on the third day, I could feel like I'm seeing, not quite properly, but I could at least see. And then after one week when, uh, okay, I was going to the hospital every day as a day scholar because I was supposed to be uh, admitted. So the results that came out after one week, you can't imagine from a stark sugar of 22 to 6.3, that are stable sugar. So the doctors were like, what are you using? Or like I found some products and I started using them and that's exactly what I've been using. So since then, that's since 2018, June, I've been using the products and I'm grateful to God because I've not gone to the hospital since then, I've not been admitted. I'm still on insulin, but they reduced the insulin from six times a day to now two times a day. I'm not using the two types of insulin and tablets. I'm using only one type that is Novorapid two times a day. And I've really reduced on what I was spending on medication. I really thank God for this because apart from recovering health-wise, I recovered financially. I'm happy because there's nothing that steals your happiness like sickness. It steals your happiness. It steals happiness uh, from the people you live with. <coughs> it steals their finances. And I thank God. I'm going to stop there and I hope we are going to recommend this product. Thank you. Sorry, 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 Mary. I can see you choked there a little bit. Not to worry. You can take, uh, if you need to take some, you can do that. Don't worry about it. Uh, uh, maybe you can take some more so that you can be able to talk. Uh, but um, you've had a story, she's explained there briefly, and uh, she was interrupted there a little bit. But um, what, what really um, excited me so much about her story is the fact that she was actually blind, uh, courtesy of um, diabetes. And she had really tried to go to so many places. She had gone abroad. Uh, she had gone to India. She had... I mean, she had gone to the best hospitals and really tried so many things, but they were not really working for her. But she started using the Neolife products. And of course, not by themselves, but she was also on insulin and other medicine from the doctor. And uh, that actually helped her to recover her eyesight. In fact, the day I met her, we were actually speaking face to face. She was there with, the, I think, the nephew, uh, and I mean, she's walking by herself. I, I mean, I could not believe it. And I said to myself, these are testimonies that needs to be shared uh, so that people can see what the power of nutrition can do um, to, to actually strengthen the body and help the body to be able to fight diabetes. And uh, she's, she's used the products now. She's used quite a number of products. And I know we'll be asking which particular products uh, did she actually use in particular? Um, I can I remember her talking about CoQ10 as one of the products that she used. Uh, she also talked about uh, the Neolife Shake. 
uh, she used that as well. The Pro Vitality Pack, uh, which she got in the kit, she used that as well. Um, and um, I'm not sure that she used the fiber or the, the zinc. I can't remember about that. But I know that whether she bought the fiber or not, the fiber is already the new life shake. Yeah, so one can be able to get it from there. And um, botanical balance came a bit later. So she incorporated it in her program uh, much, much later. But it's an amazing story, friends. And it's a story that is so moving. And uh, her kids are also using the products. And they've actually, now she's a distributor with Neolife. She's doing Neolife as a business uh, on a part-time basis as she does her other things. And she wants to spread the word and really impact people positively. And that's the thing about Neolife. With Neolife, once you find that you're able to sort out the challenges that you have as a person, you don't stop there. You pay it forward by sharing this opportunity with other people, uh, encouraging them to use the products uh, and to actually experience what you have experienced as far as the products are concerned and also as far as the uh, opportunity is concerned. And that's exactly what happened with our, uh, with our founder. He used the product for asthma. And because of that, he started doing this as a business opportunity and he ended up making a lot of money out of it and touching so many people's lives. Today, our company is in about 65 countries globally. And uh, it's a business that is growing in leaps and bounds. Um, and today we are here. I know some of us are guests. You're just looking at Neolife for the first time. Uh, Neolife has so many other products it's not just diabetes that uh, we are able to deal with. We have, we, inter we have products that help you in so many other conditions uh, from high blood pressure, arthritis, um, uh, cancer. I mean, you name it. We have products that can actually sort out uh, such issues. Infertility, impotence for both men and uh, for men and also infertility for women we have products that actually can be able to assist you with that. So if diabetes is not your thing and maybe you have another issue, the person who invited you uh, will be able to guide you on what you can use in our range of products that can actually help you uh, in whatever challenge that uh, you are facing out there. And as we come to the end of this session, I just want to encourage, uh, especially our guests, um, you have a choice. You can either buy this product from the person who invited you to this call uh, and start using the products, or you can actually join and become a distributor and start using these products, uh, as well as sharing the opportunity with other people. And that will enable you to make some extra income and start it off as a side hustle. And uh, when you come in and you, st you start small, but it grows so big, and before you know it, you have a team that is paying you good money, I remember my first check was 300 shillings, went on building in seven months, it had reached over 30K. It went on, I became a world team member, I got into the six figure category and I started traveling the world. Um, and I mean, for me, when I joined, I just wanted an extra 10,000 shillings. Uh, so if you are here and you're really looking for a financial opportunity, then grab this opportunity and let's run with it. If you're here and you're a guest and you just want the products, that's still okay, but you still have a choice. You can either buy from the person who invited you at retail, or you can join and partner with Neolife, and then you'll be able to buy at wholesale price. It will save you money, and the day you feel that now I want to do it as a business, you can actually pick it up and run with it. But for me, it was great having a chat this afternoon. I can see there are quite a number of questions uh, on the chat. I may not be able to handle all of them, but I just, I know if you have any burning question, talk to the person who invited you, give them that question. It will be, we have a channel of communication. They'll tell their sponsor and the question will finally get to me or to one of our uh, experts like Dr. Fatma Abdallah and we'll be able to be able to answer whatever question you may have and satisfy that um, information. Otherwise, later in the evening today, I'm going to share this video. Uh, so that you can be able to use this video and share it with a friend so that they can also be able to uh, be impacted positively and either protect themselves from getting diabetes or manage the condition in case they have diabetes. So it was great chatting with you this afternoon. 
Um, I thank you so much uh, for taking time to learn about health because your health truly is your greatest wealth. And I welcome you again next Sunday when you are going to look at another aspect of health uh, where we'll be discussing a different topic altogether. Otherwise, uh, have a fantastic afternoon. God bless you all. And we'll be seeing you at the top. Thank you and bye.